And you know very well that IOIC stands for truth, or we'll always stand and defend the truth. Wherever rivers will stand, that's what we're going to stand for. This is not ethnic war. We're talking of rivers history, the collective interest of river states. And anybody that wants to go against the interest of river states, IOIC will stand and resist them, no matter how placed they are today. We saw something that played out this morning, and I think that situation has been taken care of. I want to assure you, where is, the, uh, where is that this thing? The, the envelope. Bansa, where is the envelope? Hey, bring that one. Thank you. Our governor. That is what? Asawana! Aizo! That is what? about you. You have been accepted by reverse people. You have been accepted. You have been accepted by reverse people. You have been accepted by general, general public, public of River State. Governor, just assured, this is not political party matter. It is gender. I am not just saying for the first we have to back up the leaders of the Joy Youth Council, the leaders of the Besu, the leaders of Sawana, on that point, I am saying that the Joy Youth Council will stand and resist anybody. We stand and resist anybody that want to go against this government. We will never put ourselves on that. It is not a near threat. Allow anybody or any group of people, as Sawana, any group of people, to cause destruction of River State. This is a governor we came together in our number to vote for. Our PVCs are ready. We are ready anytime, any day. We cannot be sustaining this country, and yet we will never have River State. Rivers will have accepted you. You can decide to stay in River State. You will probably very well. But anybody that wants to stand against you, I can tell you for free that we are going to stand against them. Let me say you talk. Asawana! On behalf of the Joy Council, my leader, our governor, we present this award to you on behalf of IOIC and the Joy Council. We want to be operating in a secretariat where we can assemble and be doing our thing. We are autonomous zone. Boss, the things we want are listed in this envelope. Let me allow my president, which is one minute, to talk to you, sir. Thank you very much. Assassin the 56th anniversary of our hero, Major Jasper Adakaburu. This only reaffirms one thing, that the goals of the joint nation are with you fully. The entire joint nation is never divided, but they are with you a hundred and one percent it is my admonition to every dissenting voices that are within the joint nation to retrace their steps and stand behind a man whom god has a purpose for the people of river state on this historic day your governor the people's governor we are using this medium to declare and absolute solidarity with you from the beginning till the end of this your struggle. Because your struggle represents the hopes of all Ijo people everywhere in the world. We believe that at the slightest call, the Ijo nation will rally fully, publicly behind you. For those who do not want peace in River State, let us use this medium to appeal to them. They also need this peace. It is our wish that they allow somebody who has come to do projects and development for the people of River State to maintain sanity in the pursuit of that mandate given to him freely by the people of River State. Whatever it will take, the Joint Nation and the people of River State to stand and queue behind that mandate. The Joint Council is fully with that mandate. Therefore, Your Excellency, whenever the needs of the Joint people 
around you is needed. Please, we are just a phone call away from you. And we will stand with you shoulder to shoulder till the end of this struggle. Until you have achieved this purpose for River people. Thank you. And may God bless you and the people of River State. On behalf of the government of River State, the good people of our dear state, joined in celebrating our hero, Adakaburu. This celebration today is because this leader stood for something very unique. Genuinely equity. Genuinely justice and genuinely fair play. That is what Adakaboro stood for. And because he stood for that unique thing, even after his death, we still celebrate him because he was a liberator. Every reverse man, it doesn't matter whether they jaw or whether they upland. The most important thing is that every genuine reverse man must be a genuine liberator. And I'm happy that you have come here today. I've also received you because we have one common purpose to liberate our dear state. We are not going back on that. I'm happy that you're telling me this morning that when I call on you, you will respond. But I don't need to call on you because we have already defeated. We have defeated them. <laughs> By the special grace of God, what they thought that they would have done to us while we are celebrating our one year in office, they are the ones sleeping with their two eyes open, restless. It shows that we have the a job blood. And what is what is that? What is that blood? Is the is the blood of action. Let's talk more action. So this morning, I want to appeal to you. Why we celebrate? Our common merit, our brother, our leader, our father, Adakaburu. Let it be done peacefully. I beg you. Nobody should hurt anybody. Let it be a celebration that at the end of the day, nobody is hurt. We we'll go back to our homes and we say, Thank God that the celebration was a success. Please, I'm appealing to everyone. There is no cause for any alarm. No cause for, in the course of this event, we'll go and spoil anything. No, 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 no. In fact, those of you writing those things, there's no need for it. Huh? We have already, we, we, we are liberated. So we don't need to start carrying those uh, signs, books, and all the, please, please, take away those things. That is not our cost. Huh? That is not our cost. Our cost today, our cost today is to celebrate our victory. Our cause today is to celebrate the success of your leadership. Even in the face of all the crisis, division, you still stood as one. That is the important thing. So let me join you to celebrate our leader, our father. And to assure you, I've taken your request. I will look into it. And let me promise here, IYC will have its own secretary in this state. I hope you're happy now. This is the headquarter. This is the action state. We ought to have the secretary. So I will give you everything, every support, financially and otherwise, to make sure that before you celebrate the next year, we'll have our own secretary.
let me let me on this note like i said we are not discussing problem because we don't have any problem what we are discussing is celebration because we are celebrating our one year so let me charge you go be good ambassador to the joint nation good be good be good ambassadors to just not river state but all the joint clans that is the most important thing and god will be with you thank you thank you and god bless you you all know what we are going through you all know the pressure that this government has faced not as a result of his own fault but the good thing is whether you take it one year whether you take it three years whether you take it three months what we have done today is display to display to the world that we know what we are doing and we are ready and prepared for the tax of governance let me thank every one of you for your support while you give us support conduct yourself very well let me also say this here when we left a little the other day some people went there and attacked our people there's no need for it nobody is a monopoly or has monopoly of violence i should be the one who will even come and shout that i will do this i will do that but i don't need to do that because both sides belong to me so i'm advising those people who call themselves local government chairman you have a few days in office please conduct yourself politics will come politics will go we will still live our lives let anybody not deceive you if you deliberately hurt anybody in the course of maybe expressing your useless support nobody will forgive you you will pay for it so i'm begging everyone please conduct yourself as a matter of fact i'm the one that is most hit abused mumu governor we don't know what to do with power is it not have i said anything and so please just endure until when you finish you go your way i don't want any trouble I don't want anything that will bring any problem in this state. I know what they want to do, but we will not give them the opportunity. We have made our promise to our leader, who happens to be the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, that we will take the path of peace. And that is the path we are taking. We will continue to take that path. Don't mind what they say. Don't mind what they do. Peace remains the path. Why taking the path of that peace does not mean we we'll have to see, or oh, let, let me describe it this way. We turn to a tree that will just stand and see somebody coming to chop it down. No, 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 no. We need to also protect ourselves. I want to take the privilege, first of all, congratulate His Excellency and the government of River State on this grand occasion of your first anniversary in office. We are indeed extremely delighted that we have a governor of your caliber. We salute your leadership on this occasion. We salute your humanity on this occasion. We salute your humility on this occasion. We salute your propensity and preference for peace and tranquility.
see a fair bit in a governor like yourself. Our very presence here today, I believe, makes the point that we are your supporters. We don't have to talk too much about it. Anybody who is a politician understands that by standing here, I'm making a grand political statement. We are the face of the people who are behind. And we're many. Millions of people, rivers people, chiefs, traditional rulers, elder statesmen, businessmen. We make the silent majority that are behind, supporting the effort of the government to emancipate the people and to bring development to River State. Let me take the opportunity to call upon all and sundry, all our people, wherever you are, to give your utmost support to the government because for the very first time, government has moved away from the time when the governor was seen as a teen god, a time when the governor demanded worship, so to say, to a time when the governor has become a symbol, a rallying point for the people, a rallying point for accountability, of resources of our people, a rallying point for bringing all our people into the same boat. We're in an era where massive and extended consultation is the order of the day when nobody's view is thrown away. On this grand occasion of your first anniversary, we further associate with you, we further greet you, and we wish you all the best in office in the first four, four years of your tenure. After that, we'll see how it goes. You can be rest assured that the way you are performing the people will certainly rally around behind you to give you another term in office. We'll make a bold declaration that four plus four is equal to what? Yeah. 